What's up guys, Omega Batman here with another uh, Yu-Gi-Oh card pack opening. Um, if you want to see the next one, I'll leave a uh, link in the back and the end of the video. Description? Yeah, that thingy. Um, um, got a uh, special guest today, um, Mr. Ian McClure. Howdy. Doesn't have a gamer name yet. <laughs> but um, leave, a, leave one for me in the comments. Yeah, there you go. Give Ian a username. <laughs> um, one quick thing I would like to establish. Um, in a by this weekend, we'll say by this weekend, I want to try to get together a four-way AOE battle with Ian, Charlie, and Brad. That being said, there's a new game that's very similar to Age of Empire that's coming out on Steam end of March. I will most likely be buying and playing for the channel. One more thing before we get started is that um, the Life is Strange bonus episode came out, but I haven't had a chance to play it yet. I've had a very busy weekend. Uh, this week, if I get a chance, I will play it and upload it. I would love to do it by by Monday, but there's nothing set in stone. Well, without wasting any more time, I'm going to um, fail at opening this box. Because, again, I forgot to grab a knife. The plastic on these things is kind of ridiculous. They are. You got, like, a mountain of trash just for, like, a stack of cards. I bet. <laughs> <laughs> I, I fail every time I open the plastic box. There we go. It's off. Uh, the last opening I did, I literally had a whole Walmart bag full of trash <laughs> wow. just for those stacks over there. <laughs> All right, this is the brand new box. Um, went to Con and got it. Here's our guarantees. So we'll open these first. But then we've got one, two, three mega packs. More, pa more sizable. Uh, what do they call them? The packs? They're they're well, the top, the smaller ones. That's what I meant. Yeah, they're they're doing. Less packs, but more cards in the packs. Here's the uh, nice board um, little mat. Let me uh, turn this around. What's it says on fold? <laughs> oh, it's double sided. That's very nice. You have Destruction Dragon and Kaiba, it looks like, on the front. And then here's the back. I think this is the new hand trap, that image right here. Is it? We'll see. Yeah, Goddess of Sweet Revenge, I think is what it's called. Alright, we'll set that over here. Alright. All right, let's uh, open the guarantees. I don't know what cards are in here. I just know that um, there's a Ash, Ash reprint, I believe. We're about to find out. There's the goddess. Okay, we have the goddess of sweet revenge. The king of <laughs> <laughs> the king of the D. king of D and destruction dragon. And we get a Dragon Revival Rhapsody. They're sweet. I like that. And then the Loop of Destruction. I have no clue what any of these do yet. I probably will read over them at the end of the video. This card is supposed to be like really nice in uh, blue eyes. Dragon Revival Rhapsody. There's Go ahead and put it in there. This one right here. Yep. This is it for the guarantees. We'll set them off to the side there. I'm gonna put them like right here, right next to her boob. She will keep them safe. You can always trust Android 18. Okay, first pack. One of three. So we got Ancient Rules reprint. Maiden with Eyes of Blue. Very not. Oh, is that a secret? That's maiden nice. with Eyes of Blue. That's Master. Oh, did I say Maiden? Yeah. I'm at Master. Uh, Dragoonity Ducks. I think so. Reprint. Doom Virus Dragon. A Z Metal Tank. <laughs> and the most powerful card in the entire game is Thunder Dragon, obviously. Uh, um, it, if you don't know what it is, you just discard this to add two more copies to your hand. That works. <laughs> okay. If you have a poly, you could go into Cyber, or not Cyber, um, Thunder, Thunder Twin, or Thunder End, yeah. XYZ Dragon Cannon reprint, um, White Stone of Ancients, and Beacon of light. Very nice. They're I really very, like the prints on them. They're very pretty. The Maiden and the White Stone are really nice. Okay, second pack. Second pack. This will be a lot shorter than the Millennial because I'm only got three packs here. We got us a Maiden with the uh, Eyes of Blue. Dark Armed Dragon. Teledad format, anyone? <laughs> Dragoonity uh, Phalanx, I think is how you say that. <laughs> Monarch Stormforth. PTSD. Blue Eyes White Dragon. 
a um, rider of the storm winds. That's new. Oh, that's a very, very pretty mirror force. Uh, cloning. Uh, burst stream of destruction. Hey, ooh, I need that. Dragon Ravine. That's a nice print. I mean, look at that. Am I see this? Go for it. I mean, look at that. It's got, it's got the super rare print on it. This is very nice. Hmm? We'll put this right. Oh, we don't want to cover her beautiful face. Even though I do that with my hand. Enough. Okay. Third and final pack. And here. for the end, we got Neutron Blast. Oh, Crush Wyvern. Too bad I already have all of those that I need. Monarch Storm Another Storm. Monarch Storm Fourth. Um, was that Mausoleum? Mausoleum? Mausoleum of White. A Y Dragon Head. Y Dragon Head. A La Genre print. I want that to be a deck theme so bad. Eradicator Epidemic Virus. That's very nice. And we got an X Head Cannon. And um, this is an old one. The Interdimensional Matter Transporter. And then a uh, Dragon Spirit of White, everybody. Those are some nice reprints in there. They are. Well, I'll go over them one more time with the... Where'd they go? The guarantees. Right here? Oh, right here. There's the... I'll bring them a little closer for you guys so you can kind of appreciate the uh, rarities there. Yeah. Dragon Revival Rhapsody. I'm really interested to see what this one does. I'm also terrified at the same time because I have PTSD from hand traps. May I see this? Yeah. Okay. While well, you control no cards, and this is the only card in your hand, when an opponent's monster declares an attack, you can discard this card, destroy as many cards as possible your opponent controls, then you can special summon one monster from your deck. That's rude. <laughs> not very not very useful, given the game nowadays, but even still, it'd be nice to get off. <laughs> <laughs> And then um, we'll go ahead and read this one too, the Loop of Destruction, because that's uh, obviously a knock for uh, the Ring of Destruction. Uh, uh, this one's continuous. Oh, very nice. Okay, this card's name becomes Ki Ring of Destruction, almost said King. While well, on the field, once per turn, if a monster or monsters on the field is destroyed by a card effect, except during the damage step, you can target one monster on the field, destroy it, and if you do, each player takes 500 damage. Oh boy, a burn card. Oh boy. <laughs> That's exactly what Burn needs. Jesus. And then the King of D. That <laughs> makes me so happy. Uh, this card becomes Lord of D. <laughs> while on the field. When this card is normal summon, you can discard one spell trap, spell or trap, add one flute of summoning dragon, or the melody of awakening dragon, or dragon revival rhapsody from your deck to your hand. That is amazing. That is a really good It doesn't card. give you the protection that Lord of D does, but you get search for it. Yeah, that is really nice. I'm not exactly sure if that's what Blue Eyes necessarily need, but it is nice. All things I would there. play around with it just to see, because like you never know. There's there's got to be something you could use to abuse that with. But um, well, it depends on how you set up the deck, I think. Other than that, that will be the um, that's all we got for today. Um, like I said, I'm gonna try and get on the uh, Life is Strange last episode as soon as I possibly can, because it's killing me. I want to play it so bad, but. Um, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like, subscribe, comment, and share. Also, check out my other Yu-Gi-Oh! episode. Um, if you want more, I'll, I'll keep trying to bring new Yu-Gi-Oh! content for you guys. I've got deck lists and stuff that I could give. And uh, once I get my YGO Pro uh, fixed, I can do stuff with that too. And uh, see you guys in the next video.